I'm children's book creator Donovan Bixley. Kia ora and greetings from my studio in Aotearoa, New Zealand. Today, we're going to make some fruity characters, which is one of the exercises in my brand new book, Draw Some Awesome, crammed full of drawing tips and ideas for budding artists. I've created hundreds of characters for books as well as animated TV series, but sometimes it's a little bit scary looking at a blank piece of paper. Here's a trick I use to get me started. I start by drawing some interesting shapes. Now, you could start with a square or a circle or a triangle, but I think more organic shapes are a bit more interesting. So I'm gonna start with some fruit and vegetable shapes, like maybe a banana. Or maybe a carrot. Or maybe um, broccoli, there we go. Now, I'm going to turn these fruits into interesting characters. Now the trick is, I'm just gonna turn my brain off a little bit and just let my pencil start drawing something that I didn't even know it was gonna draw. So first of all, I'm gonna start with this, this banana here. Should I give it long legs or short legs? There we go, I'm gonna give it some legs. I'll turn that into a tail. Ooh, what about, get that a nose. Oh, what about, uh, give it some ears like this, some eyes. How about some arms? There we go. What about this carrot? What can I do with this carrot? Maybe I will turn that into a man wearing a top hat like mine. Maybe we'll stick a little band there. Maybe we'll turn that into some flowers or some ruffles coming out the top of the hat. Now, um, what about this broccoli? What can I do with a broccoli? Well, I'm going to... Oh, maybe I'll draw... I'm going to turn this into something unexpected. Some here, maybe a mullet. What about, uh, I'll give this character some legs. Oh, they're kind of a bit, <laughs> a bit squashed down the bottom there. Oh, he's got a big six pack. I'll give him a, a skirt, like you might wear if you're a Pacific Island demigod like Maui. Oh, and if he's gonna be Maui, he might need to have his magical hook. Ta-da, maybe a feather in his, here, maybe some tattoos. Give them some full face tattoos. Doo -doo. <laughs> Give him some tattoos on his arms and shoulders. There we go. Now we have some cool characters where a few moments ago we just had a blank piece of paper. So that's just a really good starting point to get me going. And if I was making some characters for a book, I would just keep drawing and drawing, trying different ideas, trying different noses and faces and ears and hair and clothes until I came up with something that I like. This is just one of the many ideas from my brand new book, Draw Some Awesome, crammed full of ideas for budding artists. 